when you get lads doing things like that, it's great, it's fantastic natural fact for them to do things like that. Doing it for charity and all they're going to get out of this is a lot of pain because 72 hours is a long, long while to play football. I know they're switching over and back, but when you get lads that are not, I mean a professional footballer trains every day, these lads don't, so it'll be easy, easy for them to pull a muscle or get injured or do something. It's a tough, tough task for them. And then you spend three days without more or less having your normal sleeping activities. But you see, it's, I think it's great that lads do that. You know, we were never daft enough to do anything like this. But there was lots of things you would do for charity and then. Most, mostly it would be dinners or appearances or stuff like that. You wouldn't, you wouldn't have things like this going on. But as I say, most clubs do great work on the charity side of it anyway. Not just United, every club does it. Francis House is a charity here in Manchester because we have an old players association at Manchester United and we do a lot of things for charity as well and one of the charities we have is Francis House. When it's kids it's always more important I think than anything else when it's children. I've got three kids, loads of grandkids and you can't imagine one of them being ill and you having to go and spend time in hospital with them. It must be a horrific experience.